Okay, I've got a EveryBot TS300, and uh, I'm not getting any water coming out. So I already tried um, checking this out, you know, filling it with water, pushing on the plunger here, water comes out. I cleaned the filter that's, uh, that's underneath it. Uh, so what I found out was take out the Phillips screws here and here, take these off, take out these Phillips screws here, and you pull this little panel out. And you're gonna see this is where the water comes through. And if you look on here, those three holes, um, one, two, three, they're all plugged. That's from the city water calcium. So you just gotta clean those out with a needle, put this thing back together, and then uh, it should work for you. Okay, so after you take out the um, water bottle this is the filter here make sure that's uh, cleaned out and then in here you'll see um, these holes here so what I did is I take a sewing needle and just make sure they're, they're all clear and uh, on the back side of this Um, when you take that cover off, if you can't get the cover off, you can put the sewing needle through this center one here and push, and you can see it, it lifts the cover out. And here's what it looks like with the cover off. So you got these uh, paths here that the water comes through. But on, on this one, it was these uh, these three holes were, were plugged. So just use a sewing needle and, and clean it out. Okay, so I forgot to say, underneath this plate, you're gonna see holes that go through. Don't stick your needle through there because it's going, there's a rubber hose inside that comes from the water pump and you don't wanna puncture it. I ran it without the pads in an open area on the floor. It's kind of in the center of the room here, so it thinks it's in an open area. And uh, just let it run for, I don't know, maybe a minute. And then I started seeing the water coming out. So uh, you can hear the, the pump when it, when it starts uh, spraying water. So when I first did it, I didn't get any water coming out for a while. So I'm not sure if it just took a while to prime or not. But I ended up taking the whole thing apart. And uh, I put um, uh, four D batteries, which is about six volts, to the water pump directly. Um, make sure that was that was free and working and uh, there's a check valve on the discharge side which is on the red hose and I just uh, stuck a needle in there tried pushing on the, the ball ball check make sure that's clear and uh, yeah everything was working so um, you don't have to do any of that but just so you know and uh, I put it back together but I think the main problem was just those holes on the on the bottom were, were plugged up so uh, on that on that plate that comes off so anyways, uh, yeah, hopefully this works out for you, and let me know in the comics, comments, and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.